Hey, up it's Steve from that old Yorkshire geek and a bit of um, viewer skew universe news from Kevin Smith. He says he's doing a Dogma 2, which is interesting because Dogma probably is, I don't know if it's best film, but um, probably his most mainstream film, maybe. Uh, but anyway, uh, in the works with Ben Affleck and Matt Damon potentially returning, not Kevin Bacon. You don't know what I'm talking about, but never mind. <laughs> There's outtakes where I get the the name wrong, but. You don't know that, so I'm just reiterating my stupid mistake. But whatever, right. Well, I'll be reading that in a moment. But before we start, don't forget to like and subscribe and share the video, drop a comment and hit the notification bell and all that stuff. We've just passed a 1,000 subscribers, which is amazing. Um, uh, so it's all down to you guys for subscribing. So thank you very much. And keep doing it. Get us to even greater heights, uh, if possible. Um, uh, or, um, whatever. Right, so, but uh, also to explore the description, I'm getting all tongue tied. Explore the description for various links for merch and other stuff. Uh, what what else is there? Uh, Patreon and all that, thing, and social medias, and my books. There they are, available on Amazon, Kindle, and paperback. Uh, follow the links and explore them. Right, so let's have a read, shall we? So here we go, Caesar. Right, there's the article, as I said, from Deadline. Glenn Garner reporting. Kevin Smith says Dogma 2 is in the works with Ben Affleck and Matt Damon potentially returning. Um, it's been a while since I've seen Dogma, but I'm sure Ben Affleck died at the end. I can't actually remember. It's been a while. I'm sure it... I'm sure it got... Spoilers. I'm sure God um, sort of like exploded him, <laughs> I think. I don't know. I might be wrong. It's, it's ages since I've seen it. I've got it on DVD somewhere. Probably in a box upstairs, but uh, uh, it's been a while since I've seen it. There's Kevin Smith, the thin Kevin Smith, not that Kevin Smith. You know, when Kevin Smith was funny, uh, this is the new Kevin Smith who is just apparently isn't funny anymore, but thinks he is. Um, anyway, after 25 years, Kevin Smith is reconnecting with the man upstairs for the unholiest of sequels. During his Dogma Confessional on Sunday at Vulture Festival, the Viewer Skew Universe creator. Uh, which is his films from, like, um, Clark's, Small Rats, Chasing Amy, etc. The um, uh, viewer's creator revealed that he's working on a sequel to the 1999 film and he expects Ben Affleck and Matt Damon to return for cameos at least. Some people would be like, don't effing touch it, you'll ruin it, said Smith. Because uh, he likes swearing. And I'm here to tell you, I will, I'm effing tickled, I found a way in. He sounded confident. Will it allow this Morissette to return as God? Obviously, they can't get um, um, Alan Rickman in, can they? Because, unfortunately, he's passed away. But anyway. He sounded confident that Affleck and Damon would reprise their roles as Fallen Angels, Bartleby and Loki after Smith helped save the pair's 1997 film Goodwill Hunting without so much as a thank you in their Golden Globes and Oscars speeches. They owe him. Uh, they owe him. They owe him. <laughs> what am I like? They owe him. Um, what did he do? I don't know. I've never seen Goodwill Hunting. Um, apparently it's really good, but I've never seen it. But um, What did he do? I don't know. Uh, I've been able to hold that over both their heads for 25 effing years, which is why they keep showing up uh, in all the movies, said Smith. Expect a cameo from them. Uh, more than a effing cameo, the only way we get a Dogma sequel made is if they're there. So count on those guys being there. And there they are. Bartleby and Loki. Don't ask me which is which, I can't remember. Um, but there were, there, were, there, were, there were angels. They played angels uh, that are kind of gone, gone rogue, I suppose you could say. They were going round, um, basically, judging people. And, uh, and killing people, essentially. Right, Sunday's panel marks the 25th anniversary of Dogma, which saw Affleck and Damon's buddy angels travelling to New Jersey in search of a loophole that will get them back to heaven. Um, the film also features... I don't know why Loki wants to go to heaven. He's a Norse god, isn't he? He's not to do with Christian religion, but anyway. The film also features Linda Fiorentino, Salma Hayek, uh, Alan Rickman... Uh, Chris Rock, Jason Lee and Alanis Morissette uh, as well as Jason Mewes and Smith reprising their roles as Jay and Silent Bob. Uh, Dogma served as the fourth instalment of the Smith's Viewer Skew universe which also includes Clark's, Morats, Jason Amy excuse me, 
Jay and Silent Bob Strike Back, uh, which I really, I really like that one. Um, Clark's Two, Jay and Silent Bob Reboot. Um, yeah, I think I've seen that one. Uh, wasn't it called something else? Well, anyway, whatever. Uh, and Clark's Three, which I haven't seen. Uh, last month, Smith announced that the religious satire is returning to theatres and getting a new home release after another company purchased the distribution rights from Minimax. <laughs> Sorry. When I say Minimax, I always think of uh, what Jay says about them. Those Miramax Fs. <laughs> Making it potentially available to stream for the first time ever. Oh, is it not available on streaming anyway? Good job I've got the DVD, isn't it? Smith noted that the new Dogma deal could potentially lead to sequels, TV versions, in terms of extending the story. Steady on. Something we could never do before. So exciting, man. And all those people who worked in it are still viable. Have they? Alan Rickman in. Uh, after Harvey Weinstein was accused of sexual assault by multiple women in 2017, Smith expressed that he was ashamed to have worked with a producer early in his career. A lot of people did. Most of Hollywood must be ashamed then. Uh, he also placed to donate all future residuals. Uh, they weren't ashamed enough to, you know, out him, because apparently it was, you know, a widely known secret, an open secret, wasn't it? Same like Jimmy Savile in the UK. They all knew about it, but nobody said anything. At the time. He also placed to donate all future residuals from his Minimax and Weinstein company work to women in film. Yeah, of course he did. Uh, Smith said at the time that Weinstein had recently approached him to make Dogma 2, an offer the director declined. He's in prison, isn't he? Is he still in prison? Or has he come out now? Can't remember. Because there's two Weinsteins, isn't there? There's Harvey and his brother. Um, and it's Harvey that's... Is he in prison? I don't know, I can't remember, I don't know what's happened. Anyway, whatever. So there we go, so Dogma 2 is in the works. Um, I look forward to it, because I like the first one. But I don't know how they're going to bring back... Um, I'm sure Ben Affleck died in it, his character. I'm sure God, you know, Alanis Morissette, blew him up. But I could be wrong, I could be wrong. Anyway, like I said, it's a while since I've seen it. It's a while, it must be 20 years since I've seen it. It must be. Uh, right, so look forward to that. Um, if he doesn't make a mess of it, because he kind of does, doesn't it? I don't think the latest Jay Silent Bob film was that good, was it? Well, you know, I don't, it wasn't terrible, but uh, it wasn't that good. Um, but anyway, but I did like Tusk. Oddly, a lot of people don't like Tusk. That, that you know, a Kevin Smith film with um, what's his face in it? I can't remember his name now. Um, at Haley Joel Osmond and Thingamabob, <laughs> whose name I've forgotten. I will put a little caption there, whatever his name is. You know, he, he was in Galaxy Quest and Die Hard um, 4. No, it's not coming to me. Anyway, right, so we'll leave that there. Dogma 2 is coming, so are they on the run again? Bartleby and Loki, is God after them? Or, what what they call it, Metatron? Will they get somebody else to play Metatron? Will Metatron be in it at all? Don't know. Will Salma Hayek be back as the Muse? Don't know. Will Chris Rock be back as whoever he played? I forgot who he played. He was like a prophet, wasn't he? Um, but anyway. Right, so we'll leave it there. So thanks for watching, wherever you are, look after each other, and until next time, I'll see you there. Thank you.